The 20-year-old big man from the Philippines was not successful in his pursuit to become part of an NBA team during the 2022 NBA draft. But, his dream to become the first Filipino homegrown NBA player is not yet over. According to reports, there is still a great chance for Sato to share the court with NBA players in an actual NBA game. That is through the upcoming 2022-2023 preseason games. According to the National Basketball League's NBL commissioner, Jeremy Lohliger, the NBL will be invited to at least two NBA preseason games this October. He also noted that there is no specific squad yet on which NBL team is going to take part in the NBA preseason. We will be playing at least two games, but we are still in discussions with a few further teams, so it could be more. The specifics of teams and matchups are still being worked through, Lohliger said. This will be the first time that the NBL will be playing against NBA teams since 2019. Due to the pandemic, international preseason games were held off. Now, teams will continue to test international players in their homeland to show who has the best athletes. In line with that, the Warriors will face off Wizards in Saitama, Japan. These two teams in the Western Conference will battle it out on foreign land in two preseason games, September 30 and October 2. In one of our previous articles, we assumed that Kai Sato will be returning to the Adelaide 36ers in the NBL. There is no official announcement from Sato's camp yet if the 7'3 center is returning to the NBL to exercise his contract. Although, rumors are spreading that he is expected to suit up for the Adelaide 36ers after going undrafted in the 2022 NBA draft. He still has two more years in his contract with the third year being a player option. We also know that he and his team are opting out of the summer league and they are also not planning on letting Kai be a part of Gila's Pilipinas, Philippines national team, in the FIBA Asia World Cup qualifiers. However, if Kai chooses to be a 36 er again, he can get a chance to improve his level of play. Now that Cam Berstow and Isaac Humphreys are out of the equation, he surely can get more minutes. If Adelaide gets picked to play in the preseason, he can properly shine in an actual NBA game. That way, he can put his skill to the test against the NBA's best players. We just have to wait for an official statement from Joel Bell, Kai's agent, regarding his status. There are eight teams in the NBL and at least two preseason games are expected. Due to that, there is a 25% chance that we'll get to see Kai share the floor with some of the best players in the league. Can Kai Sato finally show the NBA what he has got? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Click the notification bell, so that you are always updated in our new video. God bless everyone, and see you next time.